One second. Much better. Welcome to Christmas here in Kentucky. So my favorite Christmas tradition, by far, is when all the guys from the Johnson dorm they come out into our courtyard and sing all the girls' Christmas carols. So all the girls come to all the windows on the inside of the dorm and like look down into the courtyard and yeah, it was really hilarious. So as far as student council goes, we planned a few events. For one, we asked the school permission to have a special anchored class Christmas tree, and so we decorated that, and also we planned our first class Christmas party, and it was a huge success. So here's kind of what that was like. Alright, so one of the things that my class is doing is decorating a Christmas tree that's outside by the administration building. And we each had to bring an ornament, and I forgot to bring one from home, so I decided to make one. And I made little angels. Oh, they're so cute. I made the wings out of um, this Edwards, oh, where is it at? The Edwards or Edwards apple orchard bag. And I made the halos out of bobby pins and drew little faces on them. Aren't they adorable? <laughs> When me and my other activities director partner, when we were looking for chairs to play musical chairs during that Christmas party, we could just not find any on campus, like anywhere, like folding chairs. But I had like heard that there were some in like the old abandoned theater. And so we thought we'd go check it out and the door was actually open and there were like some worker guys working inside of it. So we're just like, hey, can we steal these chairs? And they're like, yeah, sure. But it was just one of those days where it was like pouring rain and we didn't want to carry these chairs like all the way across campus. And it was just like, a mess. Yeah, we ended up making like a ghetto rig by like this, I don't know, everything in there is like junk. So we're just like ripping these cushions off these like anything with wheels and we're like stacking chairs on top trying to find a way to get these chairs over to the room where we're having a Christmas party. Me and Lucas got permission to come inside of the theater Ugh. and we're using random things we can find with wheels to move these chairs in for our Christmas party. Cushion. Ghetto. And finally, the worker construction guys in there took pity on us and they're like, okay, you know what? We'll drop the chairs off for you. How many do you need? When do you need them? And, and we're like, thank you, thank you, thank you. Another cool uh, tradition that our school has, it's called um, Christmas in the Country. And it's the equine students that put it on. And it's kind of like uh, the story of 
Jesus and how he was born and everything, but it's kind of told in horses, which sounds a little weird, but Riley was Gabriel, so I went and watched her and the vaulting team. They were like the angels, and yeah, they did really awesome. I bring you great news. Here is the talk about the Savior's newborn. Jesus Christ, who has a baby wrapped in cloth and lying in the So one of the not cool things that happens uh, here around Christmas time. It's this thing called finals. And I did actually didn't have to like study too much for my finals, but my art one, we were going a little crazy studying for it. This card. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is Micah, does he work in the tech place? No, that's Micah Hugh Ben. Mm. But this guy's Micah Hugh Bird. Hello. Thankfully in the middle we got a break because the um, cafeteria every, the, like the Tuesday of finals week, they put um, this big thing on, it's like breakfast at, at night time or whatever, so like all the students at the school all cram into the cafeteria and we all see breakfast food like really late at night. We're taking a break from art and we're getting breakfast in the middle of the night. Where's my pancakes? What? And then after that, it's tradition to go to the um, trustees' TV dump, where one of the guys' dorms chucks old TVs out of their like higher up story windows, and it's really funny. <laughs> RD got really mad this last few days because someone stole all the Christmas trees in the building and put them all up on the roof. I think it's kind of funny, but um, yeah, she's trying to find out who did it and no one really knows who did it, but we're all kind of like, it's just Christmas trees, it's gonna be okay. But anyway, they're all up on the roof and no one knows when they're coming down. Now, not only does Asbury have a lot of cool traditions, but also the city of Wilmore has really cool traditions. Their main street's like really old school and beautiful at night, and they have this thing called Christmas in Wilmore. Um, and you can, like, all the stores open up and hand out, like, free samples of, like, cookies or hot chocolate, and you just kind of, like, go around and, like, shop around. And it's really, really cute. It's so, like, it's, like, such a tiny town thing to do. And, um, Asbury participates by kind of holding a little petting zoo, and this year they had a camel, and it was so cool. Leslie, how would you describe Christmas in Walmart? It's kind of like fantabulous, plus a little bit of cookie dough, it's plus a little dude. prof angie. <laughs> yeah, a little prof angie in there. Um, so horses and llamas and camels. Or just walking down town. Yeah. yeah. Yep. We're gonna try and attempt to go sledding. Oh, we can make silly deals on the concrete. <laughs> oh my gosh, we could. 
wanted to go sledding, but then we got out here and we realized there's like no snow. Uh, but I didn't steal this cafeteria tray for nothing. Borrow it for nothing. Because we want to go sledding. Yes. Here it goes. Moment of truth. Is there no snow to sled? Like three minutes later, we're walking back to our dorm because there's not enough Sad snow to no. fly. We made a total of two snowballs. I made a snow angel. One snow Yay. angel and one failed attempt to sled down a hill. But next time, we will most stay tuned. <laughs> stay tuned. There will be sledding on Asbury's campus. <laughs>